Hey, welcome to All You Need to Know Tuesday. We're really, really pleased to welcome back our 12 o'clock mass this past weekend. We'll continue that in the future. So um, we also uh, welcome back our information hub that was out in the atrium. You know, so if you're a new parishioner, you got any sort of questions, that's a great place to go. I'm, I'm really grateful to our volunteers who, who work at the hub. Uh, that's a great resource for us. And also really grateful for our altar servers. We welcome them back this weekend. You know, and if you are interested in serving, just go to our website and sign up. We'll get you trained up, okay? We've got some live, uh, I'm sorry, we've got some, uh, some new um, events coming up. Go to the website to look at those, maybe sign up for those. Uh, we're very fortunate here at St. Pius to have many different cultures. It's one of the things I really like about here, many different cultures in our, in our parish family. One of the things we do to celebrate those different cultures is on Pentecost Sunday. And so, uh, remember in the past, before COVID, we'd have a little, we'd set up some tables of different cultures and countries, and we have a little hospitality. We're gonna do that again on June 5th, Pentecost. And so I'd invite you to go to the website. Maybe you think you might think about hosting a table of your culture or your country, so we can all learn a little bit more about the people who make up our parish family. May 26, Ascension Thursday. We're gonna have, it's one of our holy days of obligation. We'll have two Masses here, 9 a.m. and 6 p.m. And we're also gonna, following that six o'clock Mass, we're gonna have a little event for some of the uh, women in our parish, any, any of the women in our parish. We're gonna meet over in the chapel. We're gonna have a little presentation by Christian Bernardo. She's gonna talk a little bit about the Eucharist, but you can go to the website and sign up for that. I think, uh, I think that'll be a nice night for our women. Blessing for uh, our high school seniors. That's gonna take place on June 12th at the 10 a.m. Mass. We'll have a little reception for them and their families following that. But um, uh, seniors, if you could RSVP to us, we sent out invitations to everybody we know, but if you didn't get an invitation, let us know. We certainly want to be a part of that blessing, okay? That's uh, always another highlight. And just go to the website and, and, and sign up for that. Please think about saying a prayer for our college students. Many graduations this week and last weekend, and of course they start their new careers. So let's, uh, let's keep them in our prayers this week. This upcoming weekend, we're gonna have a second collection for Eastern Europe. That's for those churches in that post-communism era. Uh, this happened 30 years ago, but some of those churches still struggle to get going. So that's what that collection goes to. We've got a very nice summer program for pre-K to fourth grade. Uh, if you visit our school website, you'll find out some information on that. Uh, we could use some help for our Sunday Kids Bible Program. That's that 10 o'clock uh, program that takes place over in the chapel. If you enjoy you know, uh, working with kids in terms of uh, helping them with their faith, that might be something for you. Uh, you can call the parish office and we'll help you out with that. Little thought for the week. Walls turn sideways are bridges. Walls turn sideways are bridges. So thanks for uh, checking out our, our Tuesday update and look forward to seeing this weekend. We got some, we got some other great readings this weekend. Again, we, uh, this, this time of year, wonderful readings. So see you this weekend.